guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about. Isn't there anyone who knows what Christmas is all about? What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Diamond. Feel free to subscribe my name. If you're not new, welcome back to my channel guys. And welcome back to another Vlogmas video guys. So, starting off this morning guys, we had to go to Scar's vet appointment because we're still dealing with the little eye situation. And this happened in November. And they said, oh, it should be better in a week. Here it is, December, and we're still dealing with it. But luckily, we got some great news today. He is literally, like, sleep. Anytime we take him to the vet, he's, like, drained, like, socially drained, where he'll just sleep the rest of the day. But we got some good news. They said his eye is all good in the clear to go. Thank the Lord, because I'm tired of going to the doctors every single week, literally. So, yeah, all that happened this morning. My head is quite literally pounding like literally pounding it's been hurting all morning i don't know but yeah but let me give you guys a little ot so i have on this hoodie that i showed you guys in my primark haul along with the matching sweatpants can you guys even see that the matching sweatpants and then i have on my grinch socks but yeah guys for today though what do i have planned i want to go to the asian market today um, I love Asian like food, drinks, everything honestly. Um, and I want to try to make pho. Well, maybe I'll make pho. That's on the agenda, hopefully. So, I don't know. They should have the ingredients though to make it, but we'll see. But I just want to go and see what they have. I've been there like super quick to grab like little stuff for different recipes, but I never actually fully shopped there and got a whole bunch of different stuff. The Asian market next to me though is super small, it's not like drastically big. Um, and I'm a little bit nervous about filming there because, like I said, it's super tight, it's super small. And sometimes I get nervous filming in public when I'm by myself. But you know what? We're going to have to man up and do it because we got to give you guys some content. So, yeah, that's the agenda for today. I'm about to put my shoes on and then we can head out. And before anybody comes to me, yes, it is still hot in Florida. I know I'm wearing a sweatsuit. I'm probably be burning when I get outside. I'm fully aware of that. But this morning when I took Scar to the vet, it was 67 degrees outside, which I know is not cold for a lot of people where they live at. But it was a little bit cold and had a little breeze. Um, and then also, his vet also, the air is always so like blaring like it is so freaking cold i say this all the time in multiple videos especially on my college vlog videos that like people overcompensate here when it comes to like what the temperature is set at in the building because yes it's hot outside or yes it's warm outside but people will make sure that the fans are on the ac is blasting and it's like 40 degrees in the establishment so love that that's also why i have the sweatsuit on and honestly i'm just too lazy to change and it's super comfortable and it's cute so yeah anyway let's head to the asian market so i got an amazon package and i just ordered one thing because i have this look in my head that i wanted to do of like an outfit and i needed these sunglasses because surprisingly yes i love sunglasses honestly i gotta figure out a way to like store these but just sunglasses in general but i feel like i could wear these all the time and take all the plastic off of them Aren't these so cute? I feel like these are so freaking cute. They're, they were so like popular during... I'm going to pick up all the trash so Scar doesn't get it. They were so popular during the like summertime. But I live in Florida. It's always summer. But I feel like this... Just wait for the look. Just wait for the look. But I feel like these are so freaking cute. I love them. I want to see how they look in the mirror though. Okay guys, I just got here. I'm starting the drink section because that's the section that they have when you first just walk in. And I'm seeing these strawberry guava things. I see these all the time in Ava Jules videos. Maybe not this exact flavor, so I'm gonna get like two of these. Thought that would be cute. What other flavors do they have though? So we get two. Then they have an iced tea. I'll try an iced tea one. Okay. I'm also seeing like this jasmine uh, like lychee tea. I'm gonna try one of those. I think that will be fun. Guys, I have no idea what half of this stuff is. I'm jamming and just grabbing stuff. Oh, we have these. I love these and they're super big. I'm gonna get two of those.
guys, they have all these ramen flavors. They have them in big packs too, but I think I'm gonna just like get two of each one because I don't want to get a big pack and I don't like it. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Okay guys, this is a section I was most excited for, like all these different Kit Kat flavors and stuff, like the matcha, the cream brulee, like I love candy and like different chips like this, like I think this would be so good, but I don't know, I'm just gonna look before I get any of the candy and snacks, but I literally love, like this is my like, favorite part, it's like all these different types of candies and stuff. guys <laughs> I got so much stuff I'll give you guys a haul I'm really so excited oh my god I'm so hot I'm like sweating in this like jumpsuit sweatsuit thing oh. guys I got literally so much stuff I'm so excited I'm about to give you guys a haul though when I get home because I had to stop filming because they started blaring like music and I was not trying to get copyrighted. So I got a little clips and then like the store got tight and it got crowded. Then I got nervous. So I was just like, you know what? That's okay. I am going to give you guys a haul. I do have to stop at Target because I'm making pho and they didn't have any more broth. He said they had ran out and they didn't, they're not getting a shipment until tomorrow. So I was like, okay, it's fine. So I'm just gonna run to the store make a return at Target and then go to Publix because Target doesn't have like everything that I need which sucks what is this car doing but I'm so excited guys like that literally I was having not gonna lie I was having a shitty day and that real life just made my day and yeah, so I'm gonna talk to you guys later though because I'm trying to drive and it's so much going on right now. Okay guys, I don't know. I just had my bank card and I have no idea where it just went. I just paid for it, paid, used it at the Asian Mart and I thought I put it up. But I went to Target, they asked, oh my god, shoot, I'm like dropping everything. They asked if I could put my card because I had to like, uh, what is it called? I had to put my card in the machine to get the refund and I cannot find it. So now I'm looking for my bank card. Love that. I really need to organize my wallet. I knew this would eventually happen to me. And they'd be like, damn it, if you knew this would eventually happen to you, why didn't you bid organize your wallet? Because, I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. It's one of those things that like you keep saying you're going to do, but you keep pushing it off and pushing it off because it's never a priority. And I literally took almost everything out, but this type of wallet I have, I was using my card holder. I was using a card holder and then I stopped using my card holder because I have so many freaking cards like literally let me make sure I'm not showing you guys anything but I literally have so many cards and yeah and then I stopped using the thing that attached to my keys because I just feel like I couldn't keep cash in it too so I don't know I'm trying to go through everything and find it because that was very embarrassing so I'm pulling everything out of my wallet because of that. Okay. Found my ID. I was looking for my ID too. Found that. Still don't know where my school ID is because I lost that. I don't know where that went either. So kind of just a hot mess as you guys can see. Like I literally have parking receipt tickets in here. I don't need that. Holiday gift cards that I think don't have anything on it. I have this. I'm a, I have this old bank card that I no longer even, I canceled this card, so I don't even know why that's in there. 
found it. I literally found it. It was behind a gift card. Love that. Okay, guys, I just got to Publix. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the limes and get in the beans pass. I want some popsicles. This has nothing to do with tonight's dinner. I just want popsicles. So I'm at the supermarket. Why not just get it, you know? Okay guys, your girl is back home. I really had to change right when I got home because I was burning up in that hoodie quite literally. So, I don't even know where to start. I'm just gonna start with this bag right here. This is in no order. First thing I got are these Lay's chips, guys, and they're lime flavor. Thought it was super cute. I hope they're good. I love lime. That's one of the reasons why I got it. The next thing I got is two things of ramen, and this is their carbonara, carbonara, carbonara flavor. I think I'm saying that right. I hear so much about this flavor and so much about this brand, so I got two to try. I didn't want to get the whole pack of like ramen because I didn't really know like which one, and I thought, what if I don't like it? It'll be a waste. You know what I mean? So I just got two. Then I got another one, but I got the spicy one. This is the exact same one, but it's two times spicy so let's see i'm not a big spicy person so yep and then i had i've had these before i'm not gonna lie i got these they're called yon yon they're like these little steaks with like chocolate dip i love these i used to get these from five below and i haven't seen them in a minute so i got these so that was super cute next thing i got oh i got another one i got two of that one Next thing I got is some drinks. This drink, I don't really know what it is. It's not even in English. Um, but I did like the Asian market that I went to because although their things weren't in English, they had like little labels at the bottom saying what it was along with the price. Oh guys, and they also had the little triangle thing with rice and seaweed. And then that I see so many people do like little ASMR things on, but I didn't get that because I don't eat pork and I couldn't understand what it was. And they only had like one with like spam or something else, but they had other flavors or other ones, but they were sold out. So maybe I'll go back earlier in the day because it is a little bit later in the evening. But this is some type of juice. I really don't know. I know it's like a lychee flavored though. Super cute. I don't know. We'll have to do a, a try. Then I also got these Aloha. This is the strawberry guava one. I've seen Ava Jules talk about this all the time. So I got this one. I got two. And then I also got the iced tea one. So, yeah. Next thing I got are these cheese rings. Cheese flavored snacks. I have no idea, guys. I love cheese. I love all types of cheese, actually. So I thought, you know, maybe I'll like these. Then I got some Skittles. I'm not sure if these are like a special type of Skittles or what, but honestly, I just got it for the packaging. So I thought that was cute. And oh, I got another. I didn't know I got one. I mean, I didn't know I got two, but I got two of the spicy ramen. They had so many types of ramen, guys. I was a little bit overwhelmed. Like the American grocery stores, they're giving you instant ramen, chicken flavor, and beef. They're not giving you a thousand different ones with different companies and all that stuff. Then the next thing I saw was this drinkable jelly type of thing. I have no idea, once again. Um, but the guy told me this was good. Like he liked this one. So I don't know. Let you guys know this is also a drink. Then I got some noodles for my pho tonight because that's what I'm making for dinner and I also got some beef and this beef is for hot pot but I feel like you can use it too for um for pho why did I just blink nothing too special but they had beef lamb pork they had so many different ones I gotta put that in the refrigerator and then a the last bag is nothing but drinks. I got this Fanta. First of all, I think it's peach, but the color just kind of intrigued me along with the bottle. So I thought that was cute. And then I got another Fanta. I don't know what flavor this one is either. 
but I try to get stuff that I don't normally see or that isn't sold in like the American mar market. Then I got this lychee like jasmine tea. It comes in this little, wait, does this have aloe? Okay, it comes in like the little bottle that aloe juice come in, but I don't like aloe, but want to try that. And then my favorite, I haven't had this brand before, but I got two. And you guys see how big this is? I should have got the normal one. They had the normal one too, so you guys could see size reference. But these are the drinks that they have at like the hibachi where you push the marrow down. I used to love going to hibachi when I was little just to get these drinks. So when I saw they had one, this flavor, but then two, how big these are. Normally, the normal ones that they sell at like the grocery store, they're like $2 and they're half the size, like literally half the size. So yeah, I think that's everything that I got from the Asian Mart. I spent about like $58, which I'm honestly surprised because I thought it was going to be a little bit higher, but I'm not mad at it. So super excited about that. I kind of want to... I can't wait to try all this stuff. Hopefully I like it so that I can continue to go back because I love drinks and juices and all of that. So, yeah. I'm not going to try any of the drinks on camera for in today's video because I want to use that for tomorrow's video. So stay tuned for tomorrow's video of me trying all the drinks. And they're not cold too. So, yeah. But I will try like the little snacks and stuff, you know. So these are the cheese rings. And let's see what they're about. Wait, why can I not open it? Ooh. Okay, I don't know what they smell like, but they look like this. I don't think I like it. Not bad, they kind of taste stale. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. Not bad. Next name. Actually, I'm gonna try these Skittles. I'm gonna tell you packaging. If you have cute packaging, you got me. Like, literally, you got me. So let me try these Skittles. Oh my god. These are so pretty. The colors are like all pastel. Like, look at this, like, pastel. I don't know if there's, like, different flavors. Okay, so these are definitely, they're, like, totally different. Like, totally different. These are bomb. Oh, my God, I should have got more. They're only a dollar. I should have, I should have got more. I only got one of everything because I was a little bit scared. Yeah, these are amazing. These are literally amazing. I was a little scared because I'm like, what if I don't like this and I just wasted my time and my money? But they had different like flavors too. Like, so they had like a pink one. They have the traditional like red packaging. I think they had a green one and a blue one and a purple one. And they're only like a dollar, a dollar and like five cents or something like that. I should have got more. I probably will be going back. This was the indicator. But then you see why I didn't get two because it's like I didn't really like this, you know. So it's like, I'm glad I didn't get two of that. Then the last thing, well, not the last thing. The next thing I have are these Lay's chips, guys. Like, look at these. Like, look at these chips. I hope these are good. They smell so good. Okay. Not bad. They had a lot of different flavor of Lay's chips. But some of the flavors just didn't sound that appetizing to me, so I didn't get them. But if you guys want a video of me trying all the the Asian market lace chips, best to believe I'll give it to you guys because I'm down to try. Okay, wait. Use buzz. I just got one chip that's nothing but lime. Mm-hmm. That's good. Really good. Okay. And the last thing I'm gonna try on camera, I've had this before, but why not? I kind of want it anyway. And these are like cracker sticks with like this chocolate dip. I love these. Like literally love these. I used to love when I used to get these in my lunch. In school when you used to have packed lunch. Like look at that. You just get the little bread sticks. They're literally bread sticks. And you dip them in the chocolate. And 
here's the thing. This is how you know this is good. I don't like chocolate at all. Like, at all. But this, the crunch, I should have got more. Mmm. This is so good. These are amazing. Okay. That's pretty much all I have for you guys right now. I'm about to chill out. But like I said, if you guys want to see me try all these drinks, stay tuned for tomorrow's video. Because that's where I'm going to be trying all these drinks. And... Yeah. Come back to you guys later in the day when it's time for me to cook for dinner or start prepping everything for dinner. But I kind of want to go back like right now and get more of these Skittles because they are so freaking good. And I want to get like other flavors too. Like, you know what? I'm going to just talk to y'all later.